energy and excitement. And then, um, you know, practice went well. I mean, he, you know, he's, this is the first practice coming off an ACL injury and, um, you know, a year and a half absence. So I didn't expect him to be in, in top shape, top form. Um, and he was not, but, um, you know, he, he moved well and it's a good, good first step. We didn't scrimmage, um, you know, we haven't had a five on five scrimmage yet. We're trying to ease into it, um, because of the long layoff. Uh, but Clay got a lot of good work in and I think he was able to gauge kind of where he is right now and, and what, what he needs to do going forward. Was he his usual boisterous talkative self? No, uh, actually, he was kind of quiet. He did yawn one time really loudly when I was talking to the team. So uh, nothing's changed that much. Um, <laughs> uh, but uh, no, he was, uh, you know, clay is clay. So it was just great to have him have him out there. When you do scrimmage, uh, do you expect him to be just, you know, uh, I guess a part of it without any any worries? I'm sorry, Anthony. Say that. Uh, do I expect him to be what? Just like take part in it, no worries. Yeah, sure. Just like any other player. We'll see. Uh, um, you know, it kind of depends on how he reacts to today and what Rick says and, and what Clay says. Uh, just kind of have to take it step by step. Um, so we'll we'll kind of we'll kind of see where he is tomorrow and and uh, make a decision accordingly. Dave, I'm sorry if I missed this, but what is the scrimmage schedule? How many would you like to have during camp? Everything is just day to day, Kareth. I don't, I don't even know. Uh, I don't have a number in mind. It's really more that I'm working with Rick every day. We, we need every morning uh, and after every practice to talk about the workload. You know, the guys are wearing the uh, catapult system uh, under their jerseys so that uh, we can track um, you know, their conditioning, their heart rates, um, you know, everything that that, um, that uh, we can see uh, during their workouts allows us to see where they are, uh, how quick they can recover, that sort of thing. So I'm really leaning on Rick more than anything to, uh, to, to advise me how far we can, we can go each practice and how much we can push them. 